Welcome back to Mediclass, Oral Lichen Planus. It is a chronic inflammatory condition that affects oral mucous membrane. It was first described by Wilson in 1869 and it is the most common mucocutaneous disease. Etiopathogenesis. The precise cause is unknown. However, it is said that lichen planus is a T-cell mediated autoimmune disease. The CD8 plus T-cells triggers apoptosis, that is the program cell death. Causes Contact allergens present in the dental restorative materials or toothpaste, mechanical trauma, viral infections, and unidentified agents. Clinical Features White striations, papules, Wickham's stri. These are present on the surface and is covered with characteristic and very fine grayish-white lines. Plaques mostly on the buccal mucosa, tongue and gingiva. Lesions appear erythematous and blisters or erosions also may be present. It affects the skin of the other parts of the body, however the involvement of oral mucous membrane is frequent. According to the study of Clark and McGrathy, patients with dermal lichen planus have association with oral lichen planus. The papules are small angular, measuring few millimeters in diameter and these may be discrete or can collase into large plaques. Risk factors Risk is higher with smoking or chewing tobacco. The prevalence in Indians is 1.5%. Lichen planus occurs mostly in older adults. The female to male ratio is 1.5 is to 1. Classification Reticular lichen planus it exhibits white patches, web-like threads, and is asymptomatic. Atrophic lichen planus. It's a rare type and pale papules or plaques may be seen. Bullous lichen planus. This is also a rare type and vesicles or bullae are seen. Ulcerative or erosive lichen planus. Ulcers are seen which can be symptomatic. Histology of lichen planus. Intense lichenoid chronic inflammation and subepidermal bulla formation, civet bodies, and sawtooth appearance. Oral manifestations of lichen planus. Lesions consist of radiating white or grey lines, velvety and thread like papules. Typical lacy arrangement with reticular patches, rings, and streaks are seen over the palate, tongue, buccal mucosa, and the lips. Tiny white elevations are frequently present at the intersection of the white lines. Course of the disease is long. It can go from months to years. Anxiety and stress can exacerbate the condition. Treatment There is no particular cure for lichen planus. However, the symptoms can be treated with topical medicines. Proper cleaning of the oral cavity is advised. Greenspan syndrome is a group of disease consisting of lichen planus, diabetes mellitus, and vascular hypertension. To summarize, lichen planus is a chronic inflammatory condition that affects the oral mucous membrane. It is a T-cell mediated autoimmune disease. We learned the causes, clinical features, and risk factors. Classification are of four types, reticular, atrophic, bullous, and ulcerative. The histopathology consists of chronic inflammatory response, civet bodies, and sawtooth appearance. Greenspan syndrome is a group of disease consisting of lichen planus, diabetes mellitus, and vascular hypertension. You can find the link to the MCQs for this topic in the description of the video. Thank you for watching the video, we hope you liked it and if you did, please subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell for updates regarding our new videos. See you in the next video, till then stay healthy and have an amazing week.